if I had to describe this build, I would call it glass cannon, just without the cannon part, and a lot faster. Also, you're not gonna be shooting balls, you're gonna need balls to play this build. But it's okay, after you're done training, you will be fearless. But jokes aside, I wanted to try Stormcold Trapper, but the leveling process was so painful and I kept using Ice Trap instead of Stormcold. My life pool was low, my evasion was low and I did not have enough energy shield. At least I thought I can use energy shield for extra defenses, but it was too low and it is still too low. The damage is also meh. Against bosses it is kind of hard to survive. Just to be clear, I never really liked evasion builds so I don't have that much experience with it and I just don't like chances. Will I be hit or won't I be hit? Will I die in the next hit or will I evade the next hit? So because of that I don't want to continue playing this build. However, because I spent couple days playing this build and well, I'm a YouTuber I guess and my time spent playing some crappy build still need to be converted into some content. So take this build just as an example and improve it on your own. Now I'll quickly go over my items so you will know what can be improved if you decide to play this build. ES Evasion Armor, Links are Ice Trap, Control Destruction, Elemental Focus, Trap and Mind Damage and Trap Cooldown so I can spam it. Unique Boots because it is basically 5 link and it is Storm Call linked with less duration, cluster traps and control destruction. Less duration is a must because elsewise Storm Call would take forever to do damage. ES Evasion Helmet with triple res and life, links are Orb of Storms, increased critical strike chance, curse on hit and elemental weakness. And this setup is used for triggering elemental overload which gives 40% more elemental damage and also lowers enemy resistances if needed. Some crappy shield with spell damage and some life and some resistances. Socketed with clarity and flame dash. Gloves, pure evasion, but kind of low life roll and also low evasion roll. Links are level 1 cast and damage taken and enfeeble. Oh and also phase run to actually make yourself look like glass cannon. And I also use arctic armor. But arctic armor is not good for hit and run builds. But I don't have enough mana to replace it with Grace, which would give a lot more evasion. My wand is pretty good. Spell damage and lighting damage to spells and some mana. I am using Hales Golem for some extra physical damage mitigation and Herald of Thunder for some extra damage. First ring can definitely be improved. Second ring is okay but can be improved. Now that's a very shitty amulet and the belt is ok. So those are my items. So as you can see a lot more can be improved. Might try using Kintsugi armor but <laughs> I don't have enough dexterity and also I don't have enough well I don't want to spend currency to 5 link it. And finally passive skill tree well it's nothing special. Life, trap damage, elemental damage, evasion and life, area of effect nodes from witch, elemental overload of course. Oh and jewels, unique jewels, unstable payload, some chance for traps to trigger an additional time. Oh by the way this is level 79 passive skill tree. In video description you will find a link to higher level passive skill tree. Stormcold trap is good for clearing packs of monsters and ice trap is good for killing single stronger monsters. By the way I fail merciless lab and I just couldn't force myself to do it again and again and again. I live, I die, I live again. By the way for leveling I was using sunblast belt. That is until I got chain reaction ascendancy point. So that's about all this build. If you decide to play this build I hope you can improve it. But know that leveling process might be painful. As for my next build I can promise you it will be great. It might even be my strongest build ever. But I need to do a lot of min maxing so it will take a bit more time. I will add a small teaser at the very end of this video. So thanks for watching and see you soon.